peace infinite waters diving deep once again beautiful deep divers we're out here in the heart of nature another beautiful day and there's no place i'd rather be than with the birds bees leaves and trees let's breathe let's go deep divers Woo! breathing in that good ass prana baby take that take that take that good ass energy i'm sending you raising the frequency raising the vibration and a big shout out to everyone who's joined the new ralph smart patreon page for all new exclusive content that's going to help you become your greatest version click the link down below are you someone who feels inadequate deep divers out of place not good enough you've come to the right place because i want you to watch this this information will truly blow your mind. There are so many people out there who feel inadequate, out of place, not good enough. I've been there and I found out that I wish I knew this sooner, right? After this video, you will never ever feel inadequate again or not good enough again. Even the cat down the road agrees. I want everyone to hit that like button right now if you support the real. Once again, Hit that like button right now if you support The Real because we got a whole lot to talk about. Look, if you are watching this video, this is your confirmation that you are good enough and you can have the life you've always dreamed of. If you're ready to affirm that, just say thank you. Now, deep divers, are you someone who feels inadequate? You might even have a very high paying job, be in a perfect relationship, live in a big house but you feel something is missing and it didn't just start today you've always felt that way there are so many people who write to me they're like Ralph I'm feeling inadequate right now I don't feel good enough it seems like something is missing can you please make a video on this I've got you I've got you deep divers hold your horses and we ain't even had breakfast yet can I get a hello there let me share with you what's helped me along my journey, Deep Divers. If you're feeling inadequate, out of place, not good enough, let me tell you this. That was me a long, long time ago. A long time ago, that was Ralph Smart. I felt inadequate. I felt I didn't belong here. I felt not good enough. I felt unworthy. And so many people feel this way. What changed it for me? What did it for me? I realized that actually everyone bleeds red. You see, the reason why people start feeling unworthy in the first place, inadequate in the first place, out of place in the first place, not good enough in the first place, is because they have hierarchical structure in their minds. They've got hierarchy in their minds and you have to let go of hierarchy. Here, there, there. No, everyone is here. Everyone bleeds red. Everyone is the same. Once you have this mindset, you will always feel adequate, good enough, and like you belong here. I can enter any room, any conference meeting, and feel right at home. You know why? Because I belong here. You know why? Because I'm good enough. You know why? Because I'm adequate. Marianne Williamson said, our greatest fear is not that we're inadequate. Our greatest fear is not that we are inadequate. Our greatest fear is that we are powerful beyond measure. And this is so true. Many people who feel inadequate, as a psychologist, I'll tell you this. They're afraid of embracing their true greatness. They say, who am I to be great? Who am I to be loved? And you've got to stop talking down on yourself, looking down on yourself. And you have to change the narrative because your story currently goes that I'm a nobody, I'm insignificant. Who would want to be around me? I don't belong here. I'm unworthy. I'm a burden. I've heard that a lot. I'm a burden. You have to start realizing that actually you are enough. You are enough. You have enough. You do enough. 
you have to start realizing you are doing better than you think. And that's what changed it for me. I was giving myself such a hard time saying, gosh, it's not good enough. I was feeling inadequate, out of place, like everything I'm doing is just not adding up. It's not working out. And I suddenly said, actually, wait a second. I'm doing better than I think. And you have to say, deep divers, that you are doing better than you think. And you have to start giving yourself your own flowers. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. Give yourself your own flowers. People say, gosh, Ralph, I've been watching you since 13 years old. Your videos have absolutely changed my life. Thank you so much. I say, you're so welcome. But before you were thanking me, I was thanking myself because I realized I'm an OG in the game and I congratulate myself every single day. This is how you stop feeling inadequate, out of place and not good enough. You have to start congratulating yourself to say, actually, I've come so far and I'm still here. You've come so far. A little information for you, deep divers. So far, you have survived 100% of your worst life experiences. So that feeling of inadequacy, that's a lie. You know why? Because you're still here standing strong after everything you've been through, deep divers, right? So that doesn't say that's an inadequate person. That says, actually, that's a bloody strong person. I don't know a strong person with an easy past. If you're feeling inadequate, out of place, not good enough, chances are you're always comparing yourself to other people's TikTok profiles. Okay, they got like a million followers and you're like, oh my gosh, I got none. Maybe you're looking at the lives of the rich and famous, right? Oh my gosh, look at their mansion. Look at their Rolls Royce. You're going to feel inadequate. You are going to feel inadequate, not good enough. Ladies, you're looking at her butt, her dress. And you're like, oh my gosh, I'm inadequate. I'm ugly. I'm a nobody. Comparison is the greatest thief of joy. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. I stopped feeling inadequate deep divers and not good enough. The moment I realized a secret to becoming your greatest version, the only one, the only one that you should be in competition with is who you were yesterday. That's it. I'm not competing with you or you. Definitely not the cat down the road. I'm only competing with me. I have no competition. I'm in a league of my own. If you've always felt inadequacy, feelings of numbness, not feeling good enough, like you don't belong, you have to start respecting yourself, accepting yourself and loving yourself again. If you don't respect yourself, you'll always feel not good enough. If you don't accept yourself, you'll always want someone else's life. And that's the reason why so many people feel inadequate because they disrespect this temple that the universe has given you. This body, this mind, this soul, it's a gift from the universe. Once you cherish it and honor it, you'll always say thank you and you'll never ever feel not good enough. You'll say, actually, I got everything I need right here. I'm good because my uniqueness is my superpower. That's what I did. I never ever feel inadequate. I never ever feel not good enough. You know why? Because I say I'm irreplaceable. Like, let's keep it a buck deep divers. You will never find another Ralph Smart out there. People have tried to imitate. You can't imitate deep divers because there's only one. <laughs> Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. If you can find something that makes you unique and focus on that every single day, you will never ever feel inadequate again or not good enough. Let me repeat that. Deep divers, I want you to find one thing that you're really good at or that makes you unique, that makes you unique and focus it Focus, focus, focus on it every single day. And I guarantee you, you will never, ever feel inadequate again. Because a lot of people have feelings of 
not good enough, inadequacy. They've got imposter syndrome. You might be overly qualified. I got a few degrees deep divers, but still at one point I had imposter syndrome. Am I really supposed to be up here helping people? <laughs> had to pinch myself like I can't believe it. Well, you got to believe it, deep divers, and you've got to own it. I own being here. I love being here. I say I'm worthy to be here. If you can remind yourself every single day, anytime you get this imposter syndrome, you got these voices in your head saying, actually, you shouldn't be there. Who do you think you are? You should say, I know who I am. A magnificent, multi-dimensional being having a human experience. And I came here to shine. And nothing is going to stop my light from shining. This is how to deal with feelings of inadequacy or not good enough. Stop being afraid of your own light. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. Say it again, Ralph. It's starting to feel like that old infinite waters again. Stop being afraid of your own light. When I said, hey, I want to inspire people. I had people saying, Ralph, it's not going to work out. You can't do that. And they kind of instilled like some fear in me. I also had support, but the naysayers were like, Ralph, it's not going to work out. You definitely won't inspire millions of people. And I had a conversation with myself like, oh my gosh, maybe they're right. Maybe it's not going to work out. And this is the reason why a lot of people wake up feeling a little bit, feeling a little bit shaky, baby, looking a little bit shaky, baby. You know why? Because they are basing what they can achieve on other people's opinions. If you've always felt inadequacy, not feeling good enough, stop basing what you can achieve on what other people think you can achieve and set your own goals, aspirations, and go out there and crush it. If you're feeling inadequate today, deep divers, not good enough, you don't belong here. Let me tell you this. In your mind, you got a program right now and it's called an inferiority complex program. That's the reason why a lot of people, they can't look people in the eyes. If that's you, let's talk about it. You know why a lot of people can't look people in the eyes? Because they don't feel good enough. They feel intimidated. You've got to start looking people directly in the eyes. Say, actually, I am another you in Lakesh in a different time and space. What am I afraid of? You are worthy. I am worthy. I belong here. You belong here. I'm not better than you. You're not better than me. I'm not less than you. You're not less than me. We're all the same. It's a level playing field. Once you have that new mindset, you will never feel not good enough again. You will never, ever feel inadequate again because you will say, I was born with a right to be here. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. I was born to do it. Deep divers. Are you someone who's feeling inadequate today? You don't belong here. Not good enough. Let me tell you this. If the universe didn't need you, you wouldn't be here. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. One more time. I said, if the universe did not need you, you would not be here. You've literally won the lottery of life, 400 trillion to one. You made it to be a human being. And Gaia is like, is this the mother effing thank? Is this the mother effing thanks I get? I'm giving thanks every single day to Gaia. It's a beautiful world, right? But so many people don't realize they've actually won in the lottery of life to be alive. And yet still they feel they don't belong here. There's something wrong with them. They're not good enough. They feel inadequate. That's because of everything you've been programmed to believe from a child. You see, the unfortunate state of the world is that so many people are being born in a prison, a prison not a physical prison, a prison for their mind. And that's the reason why a lot of people, they feel inadequate. Maybe they're not making enough money. 
Maybe their parents don't have enough money. The neighborhood they were born in, their nationality, their race, their political ideal, all of these things are programs designed to separate you. So if you're feeling inadequate, not good enough, learn to embrace unity consciousness, a unity mindset. Say, actually, I'm transcending all of the things that they try to separate us with. And this will help you never, ever feel inadequate. When I see someone deep divers, I don't see color. I see another human being just like me. You know why? Because I'm not afraid of anyone. I don't care if you're a member of the royal family or you're a janitor. You see, I was raised to treat the janitor with the same respect as the CEO. That's how my mama raised me. That's how my mama raised me, deep divers. I don't care if you've got a Rolls Royce or a regular Ford. I'm going to treat you the same. And you've got to start treating people the same based just on the fact that everyone is flesh and blood. Okay. Everyone you see took a number two, either today or yesterday. If they didn't, they better go and see the doctor or the cat down the road. Everyone is flesh and bones. Everyone you see is going to die. They're no longer going to be here in the next few hundred years, right? So there's nothing to fear about anyone. And this will help you to never, ever feel inadequate again. This will help you to never, ever feel not good enough again to realize this is a cosmic dance. This is a cosmic dance. People feel inadequate whenever they're taking life way too seriously. Whenever they're trying to fit in, when they were born to stand out, whenever they're trying to live up to society's expectations, whenever they're trying to live up to society's expectations, they're always going to get hurt. They're always going to feel inferior because the truth is you have to give yourself your own definition. Stop allowing society to define who you are. There are so many people out there, young girls, young boys, literally torturing themselves because they don't feel good enough. They feel like an outcast. They feel inadequate because everyone else's life seems more fantastic than theirs. Nothing could be further from the truth. I always tell you, deep divers, don't get caught up in the, in the smoke and the mirrors, the flashing lights, the TikToks and the Instagrams. There was a beauty queen in Colombia and condolences to her family, but she got gunned down in Colombia. On her Instagram, it was a totally different story. She's just taking selfie after selfie. And that was a terrible thing that happened to her. But there's always another side to people because later reports said actually she might be linked to some cartels. So <laughs> anything that you're seeing on social media is not real, especially on Instagram, on TikTok. Unless you can see their journey, what they're saying, hear their words. But if you're just seeing someone's pictures, they could be living a double life. So don't feel bad, ladies, if you're seeing this so-called model. She doesn't even look like that. All of her pictures have been photoshopped, edited. Same thing, fellas. If you see a guy, he could be just taking a picture next to a Ferrari. He doesn't even own that. So don't get fooled out here. And this will help you to never feel inadequate or not good enough because a lot of people are just faking it. You really want to live it. And that means you have to honor your true authenticity. If you're someone who always feels inadequate, not good enough, like you don't belong, like Buster Rhyme said, if I can't be part of the greatest, I've got to be the greatest myself. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. If I can't be a part of the greatest, I've got to be the greatest myself. That's my mindset, right? If I can't fit into society, I'm going to create a new one. <laughs> if I can't fit into their reality, I'm going to create a new one. If you're someone who's always feeling inadequate, not good enough, start trusting yourself. A bird thing on a branch is not afraid of the branch breaking because her trust is not in the branch. Her trust is in her own wings. Trust your own wings to fly to, to go to wherever you want to go to, to create the life that you want to create. I trusted myself. I said, actually, it's going to happen for me one day. I'm going to get a best-selling book. One day I'm going to inspire millions of people. I got a YouTube gold award. That's a confirmation that I was right. I was right. 
I trusted myself every single day. Remind yourself that you are stronger than you think. You are more powerful than you can imagine. And remind yourself of this deep divers that invest in what makes you great. Because so many people, they spend time compounding the belief they're not good enough. They spend time investing in the feelings of inadequacy, finding a confirmation that proves they're right. You have to start finding confirmations that show you how strong you are. You have to start finding confirmations that show you that you're good enough. You have to start realizing that actually you're living in a flash of light. Do you want to spend all of your time feeling inadequate or do you want to have a party? There are so many people out there in this world who externalize their value. They're waiting for other people's approval. They're waiting to be liked and loved. These people live lonely lives. They're inadequate. They're, they always feel, they always feel they're not good enough. So what did I do? I realized that my true value was internal. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. Once again, my true value is internal. There's a reason why I don't show you cars or mansions or anything like that. I could, but I, I don't have to do that. You know why? Because I'm rich without that. My value is in here. It's not in the possessions that I have. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. I know a lot of so-called celebrities, I'm not always taking selfies with them because I am a celebrity. I'm good enough. So deep divers, remind yourself your greatest fear, your greatest fear is not that you're inadequate. Your greatest fear is that you're powerful beyond measure. You must therefore embrace this power, embrace the awesomeness that you are today. I want everyone to hit that like button right now. If you support the real share this video, subscribe once again, hit that like button right now. If you support the real share this video, share this video, subscribe and make sure you also join the new Ralph smart Patreon page for all new exclusive content for videos, which are way too spicy for YouTube that are going to help you become your greatest version. Click the link down below. Deep divers, you came here to shine. You came here to fly. Don't allow anyone to stop that, including yourself. Woo! And that's why I'm just saying, feel so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello there? Beautiful deep divers, let's breathe. Let's charge up. Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Go and check out the number one best selling book, Deep Divers Feel Alive by Ralph Smart on Amazon and at ralphsmart.com slash the book, the Bible of becoming your greatest version. Also, Feel Alive Part Two is coming out, Deep Divers. You're going to love it. And check out the latest new book, The Book of 1111 Infinite Quotes by Ralph Smart at ralphsmart.com slash the book. The secret recipe to becoming your greatest version. And go and get the good ass Prana shirts, deep divers for men, women, children, even cats down the road at ralphsmart.com slash clothes and spreadshirt.com if you're in America. And if you're a sexy ass model, woo, with a whole lot of heart, you want to model the clothing? Well, go and buy some. And if you want a one-to-one, -one, if you want a one-to-one -one consultation with Ralph Smart, so I can help you become your greatest version. You can book it at ralphsmart.com slash consultations. Deep divers, may you realize that you are enough today. May you realize that you have enough today. May you realize that you do enough today and you are worthy. Peace, infinite waters, diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy, peace. You, once again, deep divers, hit that like button right now if you support the real. Share this video, subscribe. Once again, hit that like button right now. If you support the real, share this video, subscribe and leave a comment down below of gratitude and appreciation. And let me know how this video inspired you to realize that you are enough. One love. Peace.